Hello, this is Christina coming to you from sunny California and my kitchen corner. And today I would like to share with you how I made enchiladas using Las Palmas sauce. And this is something I normally don't use, but my husband likes the taste of this enchilada sauce. So I'm making these for him today. Let me show you how I made them. You're gonna need a, a pound of grated Monterey Jack cheese. I would say a quarter cup of diced onion. And mix it well. If you don't want the onion, you can make them without. I'm gonna use Las Palmas red chili sauce. Just shake it up very well. And you're gonna create a little assembly line. And then you're gonna need some corn tortillas. This is the brand I like to use, the Guerrero tortillas. Because I'm gonna lightly fry them in cooking oil. So I'm gonna use a skillet. And I'm gonna turn it on medium. And I'm gonna use the canola oil to lightly fry tortillas. I'll be using the Guerrero corn tortillas and just get a handful of them. Thinking I'm, I'll make three dozen. So I'm just gonna take them out because this is gonna go very fast. And if you see some that are ripped or if they're falling apart, don't use them. I'm gonna be using these for tortilla chips. Once your oil gets warm, then you're gonna Drop the tortillas in, in there really quick. Okay, so it's starting to get hot. Once you start seeing bubbles on your tortilla, you know that it's time to flip it over. And this is gonna go very fast. So just continue to do this until you get the amount for your enchiladas. Now if you have leftover tortillas that are fried and you ran out of cheese, then you can fill them with chicken or you can fill them in with beans, potatoes. If you have like a mashed potato, you can put the potatoes in there. Whatever you have is fine. You don't have to have the cheese. I'm just gonna fry the stack that I have because I'm not making a lot. And if the tortilla gets a little hard like this, it's fine. It'll soften up because I'm not gonna roll the enchiladas until they're cool. Okay, so my fried tortillas have cooled down and this is how I'm gonna assemble them.
I'm gonna make some bean enchiladas as well. Okay, so I'm going to take them out and they were starting to burn. So they were starting to burn on the top so that's all it took, give or take five minutes and they are done. Look at that, they are beautiful. And this sauce was left over from that can so I'll be using it for other meals. I can make another batch of enchiladas or I can use them for a breakfast dish or dinner. If you like this video please share, like, comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. I would appreciate it. Goodbye.